Okay guys, let's look at an overview of what, uh, what we uh, do in the security world. What types of guards are there? What kind of jobs are there? We're going to generalize those right now. For example, right now we have a static guard. So a static guard is someone that just uh, maybe just standing there in a shopping center um, or guarding something possibly at a bank or uh, also you know, working in surveillance. A static guard can also be just sitting there watching a, a camera. Sorry, some uh, surveillance screens. So watching footage of, uh, say, the perimeter or the inside of the building at night. So that can be a static guard. The next one is a patrol guard. Now, a patrol guard is uh, what you see back home where I'm from. They go around to businesses at night. Um, they check the alarms. They check the doors. Make sure there's nothing, you know, out of order or anything. Patrol like that. guard in Japan goes to different banks, to different convenience stores, does pick up and money drops. Um, that sort of work can be quite safe but also quite dangerous because you can come across different situations at night, say where there's been break and enters or domestics or whatever. And uh, as your duty of care, if you come across something that's even not so much work related, uh, as you have the ability to help in that situation, you are, you are required to in many states and countries. So one of the biggest things in security, which we're going to talk about later on as well, is being up to date with all your national and local laws. Now what I mean by that is, what is the national standard of security? What do you need to work in this profession? And also your local laws or state laws, and that, that's you know, hard to define because we're, we're speaking very generally here, like internationally. Um, your local laws could be, you know, what sort of licenses are given out for the nightclub, for example, where you work at in that area. Now, some places in Japan here, you're not allowed to have uh, dancing going on after midnight or even, you know, a dark place with dancing going on at all. At all. So there's a lot of different licenses that you need to um, be up to date with and, and be aware of. So, you know, so that you can do your job um, as, as effective as possible.